So, it's a lot of great stuff on uh, Cumberland out there. Uh, certainly, Grateful Guitar Lessons nails every aspect of it. But just a few things about this. We're starting off with this G. Now, of course, in uh, trying to carry with and in they love each other. And then in uh, even in uh, Samson. So in that same place. Garcia started doing this. So there's a cheat on that. to kind of get that feeling, but the voice is what carries that. It just stays in the G here. Little Ben Clark says, go to it now, get me up till fall. I gotta get down, I gotta get down, I can't work there no more. tells about the shredding lead, the country lead, all the different things. But just some, some basic ideas is we have this G here. also got this G here. So this G here below the G is the G 
seven right. With all the chromatics. And above the G. And then the combination of them. So the real thing about this is you get this, you know, uh, it's the, it's the, it's the rhythm. this feeling of this the most important thing is the percussive rhythm of it so even if you just stayed in like six notes trying to get the right hand working okay um, so now we get uh, uh, to the uh, the lot of poem and make a five dollar bill keep him happy all the time fellas making nothing at all by the way the, the some other fun five dollar bill work and what don't um, again you've got you've got and uh, the thing about being Jerry is that uh, in this a lot of poor men make a five dollar bill that's Bob's part of singing and that's where Jerry gets just to get the vamp Act together on the end, you can hear him cry. Some, some other fellas making nothing at all, and you can hear him cry. Can I go see? Can I go down? Take your ship to the mines. That's a CD. Can I go, buddy? Can I go, buddy? Take your ship to the mines. Now, for this, I shift into into uh, first position for this. Starts with the Can I Go Buddy, the, the CD. Can I go, buddy? Can I go down? Take your shift at the mine. Gotta get down to the Cumberland Mine. Gotta get down to the Cumberland Mine. So on the C there, the F is the, is the accent. Down to the Cumberland Mine. Gotta get down to the Cumberland Mine. That's where I'm in. I spend my time. time, time. So that 
that is a long, it's like a, there's two extra beats to the F there. So, whereas this is normal to see. Gotta get down to the couple of mine. Gotta get down to the couple of mine. That's where I'm in. seed indicate that we're you know getting getting back to the make good money part so let's do this again in real time gotta get down to the couple of mine gotta get down to the couple of mine that's what i'm in to spend my time Again, uh, try, trying to do it cleanly to get the sense across, you know. So, can I go, buddy? Can I go down? Take your shift at the mine. Gotta get down to the company mine. Gotta get down to the company mine. That's where I'm in to spend my time. time. takes that I know that Jerry sometimes uh, does that too so um, it can be a timing thing if you know particularly when you get this Cumberland Blues. Uh, so uh, I think one of the things that's difficult about the song is a lot of it's the same. It's a lot of this G, C, F, G stuff, but it's all, you know, specific to its own section. So we get another jam. Well, one thing I didn't talk about is that when I'm playing this with my band, you know, we're, we're doing this. into the main riff it's you know it starts to come back together into the singing part so you know we're all we're all over the Got the Cumberland blue. You can't 
win or losing. Lot of poor men got to walk the line. Okay. Um, why'd that sound weird? Normally, that, that part, so it's not just a. It's not just going up to the A, it has a. You know, those sort of things. It's just again. Lot of poor men got to come on in the blue. You can't win or lose him. Lot of poor men got to walk the line. Just to pay his union due. I don't know now. Just don't know. Well, I'm going back again. So, um, a lot of dead. A lot of people have the dead book where it's written as a, uh, this, you know, uh, I don't know now, just don't know, that's a D, C, A minor 7, G, right? But I, I find you can just stay on that C, T, you can just go, I don't know now. people that I would start doing the over the shoulder shot um, but the problem with that is it takes someone with me here to set up the you know look behind me and make sure that I'm actually looking at down at my, my uh, fretboard the right way so right now I figured I better get something just out for people who wanted to uh, know more about Cumberland and uh, we'll do more of the over the shoulder ones in the coming days take care <laughs>